Have you joined the club? Ask her to stop to me. Okay. Hello, good morning. Good morning, mummies and kids. Hello, good morning. Hello, Kavita ji. So long I didn't see you, ma'am. I'm new in class. Oh, I thought I know this ID. Oh, okay, okay. Good morning, Kavita ji. No, then you don't own it. Hello, good morning. Hello, Prakar. Good morning, Beta. Jedu? Jed buddy? Can you close the door? Hello, I will wait for. I think I can wait for two more minutes, then I'll start my class. I hope you all can see me. Hi, Azim, ma'am. Hello, Prakhar, beta. Ma'am, I'm new in class. Okay, Kavita ji. So, all are welcome. Good morning, ma'am. Kalpana ji. So I will start my class in another one or two minutes. Hello, good morning, Rita. Rita ji, Sangral. Good morning, uh, Rita ji and new in class. Okay, ma'am. So I think most of the members knew only because all students uh, thodi hai. So that's why I started my new batch. So yeah. कोई बात नहीं थोड़े दिन के ही बात है सो लेट सभी ओल्ड हो जाएंगे असंग्राल सो इफ यू हैव एनी डाउट्स यू कैन आस्क मी इन द चैट बॉक्स सो माय नेम इज अजीज उनिसा आई एम बेस्ट इन सिंगापुर तो मेरा नाम अजीज उनिसा है मैं सिंगापुर से हूँ सो आई एम ए फ्री लैंसर सो आई यूज टू टेक क्लासेस हियर फॉर लोकल स्टूडेंट्स सो देन स्लोली वैन कोरोना टाइम सो एवरीथिंग चेंज्ड मैम एम ऋषि न्यू इन क्लास हाय ऋषि जी एंड मे आई नो ऑल योर एजेस सो दैट आई कैन से इन प्रॉपर वे गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल ऑफ यू तो या कोरोना के देन आई शिफ्टेड ऑल माय क्लासेस टू ऑनलाइन सो देन स्लोली स्लोली आई स्टार्टेड माय यूट्यूब जर्नी सो आई ऑलरेडी क्रिएटेड यूट्यूब बिफोर इट्सेल्फ बट आई डोंट हैव दैट मच टाइम टू पोस्ट बिकॉज आई टू हैव टू किड्स प्राखर आई नो अबाउट यू सो या आई टू हैव टू किड्स सो आई डोंट गेट मच टाइम टू पोस्ट ऑन यूट्यूब 
बट या ऑफ कोर्स बट स्लोली स्लोली आई स्टार्टेड माई क्लासेस ऑन यूट्यूब दैन दैट्स हाउ द जर्नी इज़ गोइंग ऑन सो आई यूज टू टेक क्लासेस डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ क्लासेस इज नॉट ओनली अबैकस सो आई यूज टू टेक अबैकस वैदिक मैथ्स आई क्यू क्लासेस एंड सोन आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट फ्यू मोर क्लासेस ओके सो आई हैव अराउंड टेन टू ट्वेंटी और समटाइम्स ट्वेंटी फाइव किड्स ऑन एन एवरेज आई कैन से ट्वेंटी किड्स ऑन यूट्यूब सो दे यूज टू कम लाइक एवरी डे टू डू प्रैक्टिस देर अबैकस विथ मी एंड वीकली वंस आई विल टेक माई वैदिक मैथ्स क्लासेस एंड या इवन रिसेंटली आई स्टार्टेड माई ड्राॅइंग क्लासेस ऑल्सो ऑन यूट्यूब सो दैट विल बी अराउंड लेवन थर्टी ऑफ आई एस टी लेवन आई एस टी सो यू कैन सी ऑल माई क्लास स्कैड्यूल्स ऑन माई कम्यूनिटी टैब थैंक यू सो मच प्राकर ओके सो या सो लेट मी स्टार्ट द क्लास तो मेरा इंट्रोडक्शन आई विल इंट्रोड्यूस एट द एंड एंड में बताऊँगी सो नाउ आई वॉन्ट टू स्टार्ट माई क्लास ओके सो या कम ऑन द फर्स्ट वन हियर so actually in olden days they used to do calculations on beads okay so beads and tables slowly slowly they changed that something like this tool okay so you all know this tool i think you saw in so many videos or so many kids are holding this one and doing this kind of tools so this is called sora bond uh, so we have different we have a uh, different tool chinese one and japanese one so this is japanese one which is called son pon okay so they uh, what it differs means uh, whatever the beads here you have that is different from sorbon okay so and the actual concept is same but the way you are implementing that is different okay so this is a japanese one which is called sorbon ओके सो आई विल टीच अबैकस थ्रू दिस सोरोबॉन ओके सो फॉर इनिशियल क्लासेस यू नो नीड एनी टूल वी कैन टेक द हेल्प ऑफ ऐप नो अबैकस ऐप विच आई ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड विथ यू नो एबैकस ऐप ठीक है आई ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड वन सेकेंड ओके so i already discussed hold on i need to open my youtube okay yeah so no abacus app through no abacus app we can learn abacus so it's very easy to learn through abacus uh, through no abacus app because uh, it will uh, do the initial basic steps through doing through app is very easy because we no need to specify every time for kids if you are starting your kids are very young like Six years old or seven years old or lesser than four five years old, then it's better to use the app rather than this tool. Okay, because it does lot of our work very easy. We no need to say every time this is tens place and ones place, and uh, they don't have they don't they can't differentiate between the. Thank you, Rahul. So they can't differentiate between the tens and ones place, but. these steps all the initial steps if you use app it would be bit easy for them okay so if your kids are younger kids like 4 years 5 years 6 years old so i would suggest if they don't know the place values i would suggest to use the noa backus app which is very easy to use i hope you all got that app okay i will show you on the screen where i connect yeah here it is my phone so just open that app so you can see something like this okay so this is the no abac as app so it's just a sorobon reflection but here sorobon is a like 17 rod students one and this is a only 9 rod okay so if you count you have nine rods here okay that's the only difference but for the beginner so these beads are enough okay and these rods are enough okay 
so our pebbles and beads are evaluated as this tool okay so we are not using son bond son bond is bit like complicated for kids uh, so we would suggest to take sorbonne sorbonne is very easy even a three or four year can, a four year old can easily handle the sorbonne okay so the way it is stru structured it's very easy to implement okay so now let's see here the what is uh, this tool okay so what are the vocabulary we can expect from this tool so first of all whenever we start our abacus journey so we should learn few vocabulary words so which are very new to for uh, anger kids but of course for us it's bit easy to grasp grasp these points but for anger kids they will take time okay so we need to use the two fingers to do our calculation okay so one is thumb finger and one is index finger okay so we won't use remaining fingers we will just use these two fingers okay so you can see here on the powerpoint presentation so these are the two fingers that we are going to use throughout our journey so thumb and index finger so thumb finger is used to do one operation which is on lower beads to bring it up our lower beads we will use our thumb finger okay so for the remaining three operations we will use our index finger okay so up down and down so up and down we will use on upper beads means to do the both the operation up and down we will use index finger and as well as to bring it down your lower beads also we will use our index finger okay so these are the finger movements that we are going to use throughout our journey okay so thumb and index finger so thumb finger is used to bring it up our lower beads and all the remaining three operations we will do with our index finger to bring it up and down your upper beads and to bring it down your lower beads okay so uh, in our life so everything is evolved similarly pebbles stones all these are evolved as this tool okay so how uh, when we were when we were studying uh, in our childhood so we used to use the slates to write down the alphabets everything stuff so now it is evolved like electronic things right so now kids are doing their practicing on uh, digital pads okay similarly here also in abacus also before they used to use the pebbles stones to do their calculations okay so that is evolved everything has to be evolved right so here also the pebbles are evolved with the uh, something like this okay so this is japanese one which is sorbonne okay mm. so we are done with the finger movements and i explain little bit history about this tool okay so now i want to explain a few more vocabulary related to this tool okay so this is a tool and here we have one gray bar which is called answering bar or recognizing bar answering bar or recognizing bar so whenever the beads are touching these beads then the their values changes okay so come on let's see here so if you move beads up and down it will shows different values okay so how you how i got to this uh, tool so just click on the corner button you have some here green color one just click on that you will get this tool okay so i hope you all can see this one if you can't see please uh, do let me know in the comment box okay so and this is the button which is used to reset all your beads okay to reset all your beads we will use this button okay so and then so this is called answering bar okay and we have few here the blue color beads we will call it as an upper beads or heaven beads so these beads we can call it as an upper beads or heaven beads to move these beads we will use our index finger to bring it up and down up and down okay and next we have few lower beads so for lower beads we will use only thumb finger so to bring it up when you want to bring it down again you will use your index finger only so these lower beads you can call it as any lower beads or earth beads or earth beads earth and heaven beads earth and heaven beads okay both and earth and heaven beads so each bead has its own specific value okay so now whenever the all the beads are away from your tool 
if they are beads are away from your tool so this is called zero position this is called zero position okay so we learnt about answering bar or reckoning bar earth beads heaven beads okay and here you have some dots okay so these dots we can call it as an a void points okay so usually we will start our calculations at void points okay so here the first void point we can consider it as ones place okay ones place and this is tens place okay and after that keep on the uh, place value will changes okay so this is ones place tens place hundreds place thousands place and so on okay so ones place tens place hundreds place and thousands place and so on each time whenever you are going to your neighbor rod the place value will increase okay i hope it is clear now you all can see everything whatever i am saying okay so now let's set the values so today's class i will try to show how to set 0 to 9 on the tool okay so this is zero position so all the values are whatever the beads you have lower side each value is a multiple of one okay so what do you mean by that so here when you're keeping one bead up it shows the pattern of this value okay so what is the pattern of this uh, this value i mean this shape so that is one so if you are keeping one bead up then the value it is showing is one suppose if i want to set so you always you need to use your thumb finger to bring it up so keep one more bead up then it shows two okay so next keep one more bead up then it shows three the value of this is three and one more bead up then the value of this is four okay so now whenever you want to set five so you need to remove all the beads from your lower side okay and these are the upper bead values which are multiples of five okay so this is five fifty five hundred five thousand so on these are all the multiples of tens so here the first value is 10 20 30 40 and upper bead is 50 okay and here the values are 100 200 300 400 and here it is 500 1000 2000 3000 4000 and upper bead is 5000 all the upper beads are multiples of 5 and all the lower beads are multiples of 1 multiples of 10 multiples of 100 depending upon their position okay so that's how we can set our phi whenever you want to set the phi you need to remove all the lower beads with the help of index finger and use the same index finger to set here okay so that's how you can keep phi and next is six so how to get six we don't have direct a bead for six in sorbonne so we need to take the help of upper beads and lower beads to set our required number of beads so that is five plus one so 5 plus 1, 6, 5 plus 2, 7, 5 plus 3, 8. So always for above 5 values, hello beta, uh, Shushantik or uh, Ashwantik. I am not sure your name. Yeah, hello. Uh, so 5 plus 1, 6, 5 plus 2, 7, 5 plus 3, 8, 5 plus 4, 9. Okay. So 5 plus 3, 8, 5 plus 4, 9. So that's how you can keep values from 0 to 9 on this tool. Okay. So in the tomorrow's class, I will continue rest of the numbers. Is it clear? Any doubts? If you have any doubts, you can ask me. Okay. So one more time, I'll try to show you how to set the values. So for 0 to okay okay rahul okay so i can set one one two four on lower beats okay so with the help of lower beats i can set one two four one two three four okay so with the help of only upper beat i can set five if it is one's place five and for the remaining six seven eight nine i need to take the help of both upper beat and lower beat okay six seven eight nine okay so that's how i can keep zero to nine values on abacus okay 
एंड सो नाउ आई वॉन्ट टू से अबाउट फ्यू क्वेश्चन दैट आई फ्रीक्वेंटली गेट फ्रॉम लॉर्ड ऑफ पेरेंट्स थैंक यू सो मच अब्दुल्ला जी ओके सो या आई वॉन्ट टू आंसर दोज क्वेश्चन विच आई फ्रीक्वेंटली गॉट फ्रॉम डिफरेंट सोर्सेस सो लेट मी आंसर दोज क्वेश्चन सो फॉर दैट आई वॉन्ट टू कीप वन स्लाइड ओके सो जस्ट गिव मी वन मिनिट आई विल ट्राई टू प्ले दैट स्लाइड एंड देन आई वॉन्ट टू आंसर दोज क्वेश्चन so yeah usually hold on hold on usually i'll get these questions uh, from different parents okay so which i want to answer here so one is what are the benefits of abacus is it uh, necessary that i should uh, make him or uh, to learn abacus on of course you have lot of benefits so if you make them to learn abacus uh, what i would say that your uh, their ma- whatever their mass journey is there half of the mass journey is finished if they learn if your kids learn abacus okay so till uh, wherever uh, they are studying whether up to graduation or post graduation half of their mass journey is done if your kids are good at abacus okay so only they need to uh, swim the other end of the other half of the sea half of the uh, ma'am do you teach on fingers also no 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 i am not going to teach finger abacus because finger abacus is a branch of abacus okay so it's not a main and whenever you are doing multiplication and division it would be bit complicated process okay so i am not going to teach finger abacus i will go only root so root is abacus so i will teach only abacus if you want finger abacus so i have posted videos on my channel you can go through that okay so and if it is like uh if you are if you are uh, working on root then there is no need to work on stems and other stuff right so uh, if your kids are very good at abacus then no need this finger abacus and vedic maths also okay so yeah the main is uh, abacus so i will teach only abacus why we don't started from the first row why after two rows because void point is there on that row okay so after void point whatever the uh, rods you have so that we will consider it as 10th place okay it's not 10th place it's a 10th place because it does have its own place value it is 10th place so usually we are dealing with the whole numbers we are not dealing with the decimal numbers that's why we won't start from there okay yeah so that's the main benefit of our abacus so you are going to reduce uh, your kids burden by half if they are very good at abacus and what is the age i don't prefer any age okay so my channel logo is age is a just number whenever you want to start it your kid is uh, interested in to do maths i w- i would suggest to start immediately i started my daughter at the age of 4 or 5 something okay so my son is just 4 years old he can do pretty uh, much good at uh, basic mental maths okay so without any formulas he can do all the calculations through mentally okay so i won't suggest any uh, age until unless if your kid is interested you can proceed of course of course for younger kids they will take longer time okay but once they catch the point they will do super fast okay so yeah that's uh, that's all i can say about age and procedure so procedure how you are teaching is very important okay so if you don't know right way how to represent decimal number in abacus i will say beta i will say okay so actually it's a advanced topic uh, 
okay if you want i will uh, show you at the end of the class i'll show you how to represent the decimal numbers okay so whatever the void point is there that we will consider as a decimal point and the next values you will keep in the next place values okay so yeah procedure procedure uh, plays a prominent role so most of the institutes and of course in india okay so most of the institutes they know only uh, addition fact this is fact they know only addition and yeah maybe few they know multiplication okay so reminding all the stuff they will just do some mesmerizing to you okay so yeah so procedure is very important so if you are joining any institute better to know whether uh, what is the process they are following is it right way to learn or learn it or not is it your capable you is it your kid is capable to do all the stuff or not uh it's okay that's what i'm teaching here rishi rathod okay so just uh, you no need to know anything better just follow me just follow my classes and whenever i said just come online just it's a half an hour classes uh, i will take every day uh, three half an hours on youtube so one half an hour in the morning at 8 am and one half an hour um, this time okay and one half an hour in the evening 6 pm your timings okay so i will take three sessions now my my kids who are there with me from past three four months a uh, few even for six months they are doing every day three practice sessions one and a half hour practice session now they are doing multiplication okay soon we are going to start division okay so procedure uh, procedure plays a prominent role uh, how you are learning so it will reduce your time or sometimes it will increase your time if you don't know right process okay so next mental maths so when you need to start your mental maths you can start your mental maths skills immediately better so you no need to wait uh, till you get perfect with your uh, tool all that stuff so we can start mental maths immediately and next question how many levels uh, we have so how many levels we have it all depends upon institute to institute they will say different levels but it doesn't matter so what matters you know Mm, what are the operations they are going to teach is they uh, is that institute is teaching all the basic operations addition subtraction multiplication division and is it teaching square roots and cube roots so that's the most important thing that you need to look for the mm, any institute okay and uh, level size said and then so what's the next one and how to maintain that one right okay, hold on hold on so it is to levels yeah how to maintain that one so whatever you learned if you don't maintain it you will lose it okay so it's a basic thing whatever you you have learned you need to do practice there is no need to be practice like hour hours of time per day so just you need to have a specified amount of time to do your things okay to do your mental math practice so it's a lifelong journey it's not like a one year two year or three year journey okay so throughout your life you need to spend a few minutes of time to do your practice so that's how you can maintain your abacus skills okay so yeah abacus benefits so these are all the benefits you all can see everywhere so i just uh, one more slide i will explain concentration photographic memory speed and accuracy uh right brain development confidence listening skill proficiency and maths so you all know this so kids how fast they are doing i think you went through lot of videos how kids uh, they will do their mental calculation even for big big numbers so if they don't have concentration so they can't do it so that's how it improves your concentration and photograph memory means for every number they need to recall the pattern and they need to do it okay so that's what a uh, photograph memory speed and accuracy i no need to discuss anything here because i think small small kids they will do very uh, very speed and with accurate answers right brain development so what this right brain development because so here whenever you are doing mental maths you don't see any physical question in front of you okay so you need to recall that pattern from your memory okay so you need to recall that pattern okay pattern means it's a picture right so we need to recall that picture to do our calculation 
okay so whenever you're recalling something picture from your right brain so that is called a right brain development okay so all the new numbers data will be stored in the left brain so whenever you want to recall it you will use your left brain but the pictures are saved in the right brain okay so you will recall your uh, pictures all the pictures from your right brain okay so every time whenever you're doing abacus you will use your right brain a lot okay so that's how it improves your right brain uh, development next we have confidence you see how kids uh, once they will get at good speed you just look at them how confident they are so this confident uh, doesn't stops at one place okay so it spreads throughout the, all the subjects you can see the difference and they will know first of all how to learn things okay how to learn things through abacus and listening skills so of course uh, if you don't have in front of you anything and you need to listen and you need to process the data means you should have good listening skills and proficiency in maths so of course we will get good proficiency in maths ma'am when you take uh, when you take the our drawing class or oh, uh, rather beta yeah now 11:30 we have drawing class beta so that is also for half an hour but sometimes uh, 5 to 10 minutes uh, plus or minus okay so yeah i will take that class at 11:30 your time if i'm not wrong 11 o'clock or 11:30 rahul are you there <laughs> so actually i'm in singapore right that i need to convert every time 2 o'clock 2 o'clock means uh, 11:30 i think yeah yeah 11:30 to 12 and that too i'll take lot of classes i'm bit confused with the timings okay of course that's a live class you can join it okay so you can see how my students are drawing on my community tab okay and even i have my drawing channel okay so if you are interested i will share my channel too okay and next thing uh, i want to explain procedure so yeah it's a very important thing i already told so if you have right plan if you know where to keep your pressure so then you can execute things in very and fast efficient manner okay so my kids they just joined uh, three four months back they will do pretty good speed compared to other institutes all that stuff okay so yeah because we follow right procedure so we know we have our good plan and where we need to put pressure and yeah where we need to apply our thing when we need to practice all that stuff we will do in a pretty good manner so yeah that's why we achieved in less span a uh, very good speed and next mental mass and maintain these things i already discussed so yeah that's the class so i have posted all the videos on my channel if you want you can go and whenever if you missed any class you can attend the classes through that videos also okay so if you have any doubts you can ask me personally or you can ask me here also i am ready to help out okay so daily mere classes uh, youtube pe four classes not four five six six classes kabhi kabhi six hote kabhi kabhi five hote so minimum three class to hoenge so three practice session abacus ke liye uh, vedic maths uh, weekly once hota hai aur uh, IQ क्यू क्लासेस होंगे आई क्यू क्लासेस में बच्चों को प्राइजेस भी देती हूँ बहुत ज़्यादा नहीं थोड़ा अमाउंट बट स्टिल आई विल गिव प्राइजेस टू द स्टूडेंट्स दोज हु आर डूइंग प्रिटी गुड प्रिटी गुड स्टाफ और क्या बताना है मुझे या ऑफकोर्स आई टेक ड्राॅइंग क्लासेस ऑल्सो दैट इज़ ऑल्सो ऑन यूट्यूब ओनली सो यू कैन गेट द लिंक सो जस्ट सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल तो यू कैन सी एवरी थिंग हाउ माई स्टूडेंट्स आर डूइंग ड्राइंग कैसे करते हैं पढ़ाई कैसे करते हैं और मैं कैसे बोलती हूँ ये सारे चीज़ें आप मेरे कम्युनिटी टैब में देख सकते हो सो यू कैन सी आई आई हैव लाइक मेरे पास डिफरेंट कंट्री से स्टूडेंट्स है सो आई हैव स्टूडेंट्स फ्रॉम सिंगापुर दुबई बहरीन पाकिस्तान और इंडिया के हैं ठीक है सो यू कैन सी एवरी थिंग ऑन माई कम्यूनिटी टैब और मेरे क्लासेस के रिसेंटली आई स्टार्टेड ड्राॅइंग जस्ट थ्री क्लासेस ही हुए थे सो रिसेंटली आई स्टार्टेड ड्राॅइंग क्लास बिफोर आई बिफोर आई डेंट यूज टू टेक ड्राॅइंग क्लासेस आई जस्ट यूज टू टेक माई अबैकस वैदिक मैथ्स एंड आई क्यू क्लासेस 
सो बने रहिए मेरा चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कीजिए सो एंड द नेक्स्ट फ्यू इन द नेक्स्ट कमिंग क्लासेस आई वॉन्ट टू टेक ओलम्पियाड कोर्स ऑल्सो ओके सो आई विल लेट यू नो एवरी थिंग थ्रू माई ग्रूप थ्रू माई चैनल ओके आई होप आपको सेशन थोड़ा बहुत हेल्पफुल होगा एटलीस्ट आप किस इंस्टीट्यूट से चूज़ करना है इस जानकारी के लिए या बेसिक इन्फॉर्मेशन आपको मैं यहाँ देने की कोशिश की थी सो दैट्स इट फॉर टू डेज क्लास देन सी यू इन द नेक्स्ट सेशन तो कल मिलते हैं फिर दूसरे सेशन में इसी टाइम पे थैंक यू सो मच ऋषि राठौर जी तो अगर किसी के कुछ डाउट है मुझे ज़रूर बता देना सो इवन इवन आई फो गॉट टू से मैं मम्मी इसका भी अबैकस चलाती हूँ सो so, मम्मीज़ uh, भी मेरे क्लास ज्वाइन होते हैं मम्मीज़ का बैच वेनसडे बाय प्राखर बेटा मम्मीज़ का बैच होगा uh, कब होगा वेनसडे और uh, और फ्राइडे होगा तो वहाँ पे मम्मीज आके प्रैक्टिस करेंगे पहला हम बहुत सारे मम्मीज थे मतलब एट नाइन मम्मीज थे बट धीरे धीरे मम्मीज दो ही हो गए हैं ठीक है डोंट एक्सपेक्ट दैट I have a lot of students. I don't want to fabricate anything over here. I just want to be as fair as I can. Thank you so much, all of you, for joining my session. So yeah, ये मम्मी इसका बैच है. Thank you so much, प्राकर बेटा. मेरे बच्चे सारे जानते हैं सारे चीज. So yeah. Thank you so much, Amrish Dikshita. So you asked me to show decimal decimal one, right? So let me show you that one on the screen. Yeah. So ten point one. I already told. So yeah. So this is ten one zero ten, and this is this void point. Uh, we will consider it as an a decimal point, and this is. Tenth place. You said point one, right? So point one means tenth place value. Okay. So in tenth place value, we need to set point one. Oh, is it showing ten point ten zero one zero? It should show zero one. Huh. Sorry. Okay. Sorry. Oh, I is pe nahi bata pa rahi hu. I think this app doesn't support ten point one or ten point one ten point zero right? Hold on, hold on, hold. तब भी एक मिनट. मैंने यहाँ पे रखी थी. Oh okay. Yeah yeah yeah. Now 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 it is showing. Ten point one. Okay. So yeah, that's it. Uh, Ma'am, please send the link drawing class. ओके ओके सो आई हैव अनदर ग्रुप आई विल ट्राई टू शेयर इट दैट ग्रुप सो प्लीज ज्वाइन दैट ग्रुप उस ग्रुप में आप ज्वाइन हो जाओ फिर आपको लिंक उसी टाइम पे आ जाएगा ओके सो थैंक यू सो मच बाय बाय बाय